Did you come alone? Yes, as we agreed. Very well, my men are outside right now. Right, well my client is a very powerful man and he wants to offer you a job. So what's in it for me? First of all, there's a lot of money on the table. And second, you can see all of your enemies gone. I'm listening. No, not now. So, do you accept this offer? Um... I'm gonna put some dirt in your eye. Huh? Where do you think you're going? Offer is still up. <laughs> now, you're mine. <laughs> Wanna cry? Please. I'm no f***ing hero! Hey! What is wrong with you? What? What have I done? I've watched you fight. You don't kill or beat men this way. Something's wrong with you. You're right. And next time, don't meddle with my stuff. I can't believe I might have killed Flint Marco and nearly beat that other guy to death. So what? He had it coming to him. No, no, no. Those weren't my thoughts. It's a suit. It's changing me. I'm done with this suit. Otto, how long have you been working for? Peter, oh my god, you gotta see this. And wait, wait, I haven't been... It's 8 a.m.? Were you working all night again? I... I guess I just lost track of time or something. Otto, you need to sleep. Y yeah, I, I know, I just... I really think last night I was onto something, Peter, you know? What is it? Why don't you just look for yourself? What? You solved the energy output defect? Oh, and that's not all. I also fixed the neural network issue that we had by adding a cerebral inhibitor to protect higher brain function. Well, let's check. Globbling green. It looks amazing. Excuse me, miss. You're not supposed to be here. Oh, Miss Transport, I'm so sorry. What is your name? Gwen Stacy. I was just picking up some work for Dr. Connors. Hey, Harry. Pete, what's up, man? So, how's it been? Oh, you know, college, Bugle, and Dr. Octavius. Peter, you know I don't have to get a job at the Bugle or work for Otto. I could just get a job for Oscorp. I don't know. Come on, Pete. My dad would hire you in a heartbeat. I'm doing good with Otto. Bugle is going to pay me more, hopefully, if I get the staff job. Pete, no offense, but Otto hasn't really accomplished anything. Harry, I don't work with Otto for the fame or money. I work with him because of what he has up here. I really hope you're right, Pete. So, how's Oscorp been? Oh, you know, lots of papers and applications. Hey, if that's what it takes one day to become a CEO. Damn right. <laughs> so, you talking to any girls? Well, there's a Gwen. That girl still? Come on, Pete. You could do better. I don't know, Harry. I'm finding new girls all the time. Pete. You all right? Uh, I have to use the restroom. Why'd the boss want this Oscorp tech anyways? The boss is working on a project. He hasn't told me what. Ah! Hey, boys. Now for you, my spider sense. Ah! Spider-Man. It's like the third time this year. Take this! You piece of... Ah. Get over here. So, I just put this wall in here. What do you think? Oh, you mother fuck! Sorry about that.
You know, I don't do very well with tall buildings and heights. Do you feel that, spider? That's my sweet venom going into your bloodstream. I can't go down. Ugh. Not like this. That was hard. I don't remember him being able to fire acid venom though. Did someone help him? If someone did this to help Scorpion, then that means they could be helping other villains. And if that happens, then I'm in serious trouble.